Okay, guys, I've got a, I've got a couple of questions here. Um, obviously, we, we, um, we get some questions from, you know, our massive viewership that we have currently, Barney. I mean, we, we broke the internet after episode one. Um, so we, we, we did have some questions. <clears throat> but this one is actually a challenge. It's, um, you, you must try not to laugh. But, but you can laugh because you, you've got to make, uh, it needs to be funny as well. Okay, Barney? Do you understand the rules? Is it a must laugh or a mustn't laugh? No, um, you decide yourself. Try not to laugh. Okay. But if you don't laugh at all of them, then I'm going to feel bad. So try, okay. try laugh at, at least one or two. Okay. But it's questions. What do you call someone with no body and no nose? Nobody knows. Nobody knows. Nobody knows. Yep. Okay. Yes, good answer. Like okay, you've got body. one. We can make it a competition. <laughs> you've got one. What time did the man go to the dentist? 2.30. Okay. He's got the poker face. I like it. <laughs> What's Forrest Gump's password? One, Forrest, one. I like that. I'm going to laugh at that. <laughs> Funny. I think his screen froze. No, no, he, I think he <laughs> okay, here's one for you. Here's one for you, Bonnie. Yeah. What rhymes with boo and stinks? You. <laughs> Not. That's terrible. Nothing. Okay. That's terrible. Okay. What did the What did the drummer name his twin daughters? Anna one. Anna two. Not. Okay. No. Not that one. Okay, last one. <laughs> last one. It's actually not that great. I, th I, definitely think, I definitely think the screen froze. What do you call a guy with a rubber toe? Roberto. No. No, no, no not, not good. Okay. <laughs> not good. That is it. <laughs> That's terrible. Those are my jokes. Your, your jokes are about as good as your cooking. <laughs> my what? You're cooking. That's you're right. cooking. No, no, your jokes <laughs> are as good as your kicking. Uh, yeah, that's very true. That's very true. I lay at the bottom of a ruck at Newlands, bless Newlands, nearly we gone now. We don't have to share these stories. Right though. after half time, and obviously John, you know, all backs, they put the big spray on it. So I'm lying like this. Obviously, it was a bit of a messy exit, but I can see John de Villiers lying on my back, and I'm starting to giggle already because I know. This is going to be comedy. If it's a good kick, it will be basically dropping a ball, hacking it, and some it goes out. Catches it perfect. As he drops it, it gets stuck in his right hand. So it starts moving to the side. He kicks it backwards. He kicks it out five meters behind him. I start laughing. I run at him. I'm like, John, John, that's amazing. He tells me to piss off. So serious. So upset. I'm like, and never kick it. Just run it, boy. Don't try and kick it. I can't even remember. I can't remember if you were captain or if I was captain. But I mean, it was a it was a bigish game, and I yeah. think we won at the at the end. But it's like literally, you know, it was just after half time. I'm in the fly off position. I want to kick it, yeah. and he li he literally lies on the bottom at the bottom of the ruck and starts laughing when he sees <laughs> when he saw when he uh, went, went. So uh, yeah. yeah, good kick, old days. Kicking terrible. Hey, run it. I remember when Jake White was trying to make him fly off? I was like, well, I mean. That, that's pretty much my death sentence. That's like cleaning 90 rucks in 80 minutes. I mean, because it's not going to kick. There's only one coach that John could have played flower for, and that's Harry Fillion, because he didn't want any kicking. No kicking. Yes. Yeah, that's true. That is very true.